So how far are you going to go out today, John? Now to watch on the monitor. And the bottom one is how far away you are? Yep. One on the left center is speed. Really bumpy out there. One on the right is altitude. Just about to a mile. Just past a mile. And John's just getting warmed up. This is the farthest this airplane's been so far. Oh, yeah? Of course, John's a veteran of flying out quite a ways. Oh, we just had a hit. A couple little ones. Really rough up there. That's the problem with this area. There's that five second hit or whatever you see every once in a while. Yeah. The there's cell phone tower some, or there's something. There's some noise in the air. Don't know what it is, but yep. You know, screws with it. Is that the river down there? Yep. Nice. That's the Nooksack River, folks. You see straight ahead in the center, that's Wiser Lake. Nice. Alright, almost at two miles, and you can see Wiser Lake right there on the horizon. Bellingham. There's the guide. It's official. Come back. Hit the two mile mark. John's circling back. Here's where the guide crosses the Nooksack. There's Linden. Good old Linden. Flying right over the next sack. John's got a pan and tilt camera on his FPV plane here. Anybody fishing? <laughs> now that would be awesome. Farmer. <laughs> Test return to home. I'll let it do its own work today and see if it'll make it. Will it land for you? No. Hopefully it'll bring it back. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, John's just about a mile out using the return to home feature. Look around a little bit. It's bringing us right back. Nice. It's nice when this technology works right. <laughs> John's found out that it doesn't always work right. Yep, it's been a head scratcher. Is that a car down there? I can't really tell. And you've got a GoPro on this one, right? Yep. It's up above this camera. And it's recording? Yep. Cool. So check out John's channel to see what it looked like in person without all this information on the screen. John VH 541. John VH 541. Check it out. It's getting close enough that we can hear it. You probably can't because of the wind. But it's getting in real close, and I'm going to try and capture the landing and round out this video for you guys.